Good afternoon, everybody. Colin here with iRevews.com, and today I'm going to show you how to uh, clear up some space on your hard drive on your Mac. I'm currently running Mac 10.10 uh, .10 Yosemite. Um, so I'm going to go to About This Mac and go to Storage. And I have a couple different drives in here because I am running the uh, mid 2012 Mac Pro. Um, so I can have up to four drives. I currently have three, and that's just my USB, which has my um, my flash drive on it. Or not my flash drive, my SD card in it. Um, but this is the main drive right here, the one that has the operating system on it, which is the 240 gigabyte solid state drive. Um, and if you're like me, you're not going to spend a bunch of money on a solid state drive, or at least not on a big one. Um, this computer originally came with a one terabyte drive, which is th this one down here. It's now in the third bay. Um, and this 160 uh, gigabyte SATA disk is not really stuff, not really want to keep important stuff on because it's like a really old drive. And um, I mean, it's been fine, but I just don't trust it with important files. But um, you can see right here on devices all the different things. Um, here's the Mac Pro, and that's the. Uh, this is the drive with all the stuff on it, so you want to be uh, careful deleting stuff off here. Um, don't delete anything out of the library or system. Um, I guess you can get rid of that if you want to, but I'm not going to mess with it. Um, under users, you can find your desktop stuff, which is these icons right here. Um, so you can either delete them off the desktop or in here. Uh, these icons are stuff that I use, so I'm not going to delete them. And I actually already cleared uh, this stuff up, so I'm not going to be um, deleting anything in this video, I'm just going to be walking you through it. But anyway, I have a folder right here which is called app, that's for the um, app I made for my friend that just has all that stuff in there so it cleans up the desktop. Um, X-Play 9 is a game, so it's got all that stuff in there. And then that's a documentary I bought um, from some, the website it was published on, they, I think they went out of business, so you had to download it or you couldn't watch it anymore. Um, so that's right there. Um, applications is right here, maybe, might be right here, um, okay, I don't know why that didn't come up, but, uh, anyway, here's the applications, you can delete them from here also, um, or here, I don't know why they're not there, that way, mm, they're there, okay, so you just can't go in the user, uh, I guess I don't have any user specific applications. Um, so just go to applications right here under the SSD and you can delete them from there also. Um, like I said, library, that's all stuff uh, for the computer and system is all stuff for the computer um, that it needs to run. So don't touch any of that. Um, time machine backups are on that other drive. Um, so it's two partitions, so uh, videos and Time Machine backups are on the one terabyte disk. Um, so any large files like videos, I wouldn't recommend keeping on your SSD if you have a small one. So when you're in Final Cut, have it export to the um, videos drive, which you can easily set that. Um, I think I've done a video on that before. But like I said, I already published this video, so I'm going to go ahead and delete it. And make sure you empty your trash too, because that will uh, clear up space if, if you delete it from here, it's not going to fully delete it. It's still going to be in the trash, so you need to empty the trash to fully free up that space. Um, like that, like I said, storage doesn't have anything important on it. It's just like the uh, Steam library, which I deleted Steam on my Mac, so I can go ahead and empty that. Um, but anyway, the Macintosh SSD, like I said, clear out your applications. And then all the stuff up here is um, stored in your in your uh, SSD as you can see right here it says where it is and so what you're going to want to do is go to like documents and if you don't have any documents you need um, like that's for my mouse so that's going to stay but I had a bunch of documents here that I didn't need so I got rid of all of them um, and if you want I think there's a way you can change uh, where it saves to I don't know how to do that um, if you can, I don't think you can, I don't know, I haven't figured that out yet, but if you can move that to a different drive to have it automatically save stuff like that to a different drive, 
Um, like I don't need my documents on my SSD. I can have that go to um, the storage drive. That would be nice, but I don't know how to do that. I haven't figured that out quite yet. But if I figure that out, maybe I'll make a video on doing that too. So that is how you check that and clear up some space. And then you can go back here and it'll tell you how much you freed up. Like that was like 103 and I got it up to 109. On which I have some games I've downloaded, so that's taking up some space. But that's how to free up some storage space on your Mac. I'm ColinThyropReviews.com. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe.